Hi everybody, welcome to my channel Frugalissima. My name's Sam, this is where I talk about all things sewing. I've got a live broadcast for you today. Uh, husband's still got COVID, so I'm out walking the dog and I thought we'd change the scenery for you a bit. So if you can hear the birds singing, that's why I'm by the canal. So I'm just gonna pan you around so you can see my, what I can see. And lovely, lovely sunset coming. So I'm coming on every day to tell you about a new prize for the challenge and uh, what vloggers to expect. So today we've got Claire from Stitch Hem so her video is already up and then we've got Jojo from Flat Battery Makes. So you've probably not heard of Jojo before on YouTube because this will be her first video and she's struggling a little bit with the editing so I'm hoping that it will be up by the time I've got this edited and up. And we've got a prize from Jojo as well. She has very, very kindly wanted to give something back to the sewing community. She wanted to donate a voucher to one lucky winner of £25 to spend in any shop that you like sewing related. So probably fabric, but you might want to buy a pattern or something like that. So thank you Jojo for that and I will put the playlist down below in the description box and hopefully that will be linked into her video. <laughs> Sorry about Rogue. <laughs> You can't, you can't work with children and animals, can you? So the second prize reveal that I've got for you is from Patterns for Pirates and they have very generously donated $20 to spend in their store and I will share my screen now and we shall go through some of their patterns that they've got available. They've got over 150 patterns, I think, so plenty to choose from. So apologies, there are actually 248 patterns on the Patterns for Pirates website for adults and children. There are patterns for V-shaped figures, which goes up to five foot 10. And then you've got lots of patterns for uh, women or curvy figures. And they're subdivided down into dresses, which is further subdivided down into knits and wovens. And just looking at the knit dresses here, you've got lots and lots to choose from, from your classic fit and flare kind of dresses to something a little bit more dressy or something a little bit more summery. You've got lots of choices here. Most of the patterns are for A0 or A4 printing and there are projector files as well. So just looking at this all buttoned up pattern that they've got here, I thought I'd just focus on this one. There's lots and lots of options for this one. It's a tight fitting kind of cardigan that can be worn as a dress all buttoned up or just as an over layer and all sorts of options there. And then there's quite a lot of bundles on patterns for pirates where they've got a pattern that's suitable for all of the family. So this Go Team jersey, great for sporty people. There's choices for sleeve lengths and you can have a hood on it and a dress version as well, which is a little bit slimmer fit and something for all the family. And then there's this lumberjack shirt that can be worn as a shirt or fully lined and can be worn as a coat. This is the sort of thing that my husband would wear is this. And again, you've got an option for a hood, different sorts of cuffs on it and available as a bundle as well. So with that bundle, it goes from a baby, three months old, right up to an adult, up to a 61 inch hip. And a lot of the patterns do go up to either 6XL or 5XL. So you've got lots of choices here um, to spend your, your money on, even swimwear and underwear. So the $20 will be easy to spend, I think. So onto the free patterns that Patterns for Pirates have got now. They've got lots of accessories and things for children. But I thought these peg legs would be a great addition to anybody's wardrobe. So many variations to these. So the basic peg legs have two rise options and then you've got four leg lengths and then they've got add-on packages whereby you can add on colour blocking or pockets and give them a more athletic, sporty look. You will need something with a really good stretch on these but I thought these ones were great for scrap busting if you had lots of bits of lycra that you needed to use up for the challenge. And then they've got the maternity option as well. This has got uh, choices of where you have the band on your peg legs. So you can have it an underband, a cross band, or you can have a, an overband 
on the peg legs. So it makes them really comfortable for different situations. And then the tulip tea, I think this has possibly been developed with nursing babies in mind, but I think it's equally wearable by anybody. But there is a nursing option. You can have it with the cross at the back or at the front, or you can completely omit the cross part of it and just have it as a plain T, different sleeve lengths, and just a lovely top. Just loves fitting, and as you can see here, ideal for maternity for breastfeeding because it's got this nursing underlayer to it. The recommended fabric for this is something with a little bit of drape, so a modal or a bamboo jersey, something like that. And there's also a child's version of this, which is quite cute. So you can have a mummy and me outfit. And then you've got the teeny beanie and the petite pegs are called. And the wee lapped shirt as well. The lap makes it easy for them to get on and off. They go from preemie up to 12 months. I've made all three of these for my granddaughter, so I can recommend these patterns are lovely. And then finally, you've got the unisex PJs, which are for woven fabrics. You can have them long or short, and they're available for children as well. So I hope you enjoyed that live outside broadcast, and I will be back tomorrow with another video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.